Hey, what's happening everyone? I'm Tyler Feldman. You know it's a big night on the 40 acres when these guys, that guy, that guy, two of UT's favorites, Bevo and Steve Sarkeesian, are at the Moody Center for tonight's Big 12 showdown between Texas Tech and 10th ranked Texas. Rodney Terry and his Longhorns coming off that huge comeback win over TCU Wednesday night. Down by as many as 18 against the Horned Frogs. That went over the Horned Frogs, their largest come from behind victory since 2013. Of course, Dylan Mitchell and the Longhorns hoping to get off to a much better start tonight. Unfortunately, Mark Adams squad had other ideas. Texas does score first, but trails the rest of the first half. Former Longhorn Jalen Tyson step back beauty. Two of his 12 Red Raiders up 31 20. Little later, Serge Abari Rice. Nice. The steal the other way. Goes up for two, no, but Mitchell says yes. Clean up at aisle two. At the half, Texas trailing 34-25. Second half, Marcus Carr time. Shot clock winding down. Yes, sir. Team high 20 for number five. Horns also buckling down defensively in the second 20. Christian Bishop, the steal. And here go the Horns in transition. Serge Barry Rice to Arterio Morris. Back to Rice. It's good. Three of his 18 off the bench. We're tied at 44. Texas riding a 9-0 run to take its first lead since up 2-0 in the first half. Red Raiders fight, though. Tied things back up at 53. Timmy Allen, though, tough down the stretch. That man's a gamer. He had 17. Carr up ahead. Allen. Mm-hmm. Tasty. Texas comes all the way back again this time from 12 down to take down Texas Tech 72 to 70. College basketball, right? Just another Saturday. Um, you know what? Uh, you know, the Big 12, highly competitive league. Uh, we knew we were going to come in and get a, uh, a really, a, a really well coached team that was prepared to come in today and play at a very high level. Coach Adams does a great job and we've got a lot of respect for him and his program. Um, you know, I give my guys credit. They, they really battled and they were prepared enough for the challenge today. Hey, Longhorns now 8-1 and one under Rodney Terry. 15-2 and two overall, 4-1 and one in conference. Next up, they visit a top 15 Iowa State team Tuesday night.